Okay, so I'm going to show you the system in the camper. We're going to press on to start with and you can see that we've got the leisure battery is coming up as fair. She's not long come back in and you can see there is illumination there from red, amber up into green and she is currently charging by solar in the sun. Next, I'm gonna press this button because we don't usually want to see that one there. I usually just go through and we can see the fresh water and the wastewater. That's the main one you want to leave it on. So the other ones, we've got lights and lights and then we've got our water pump. You will hear the water pump start and then once you're up to pressure, we'll go off. I am gonna pop it off because if there is no water in the system, it can damage the vehicle operation. So that's all we need on here. There are light switches around the vehicle um, once these two are on. Then I'm gonna work over to the heating system. It's a little bit different than our other motorhomes. So I'm gonna wave at it and you will see it will come to life. First of all, we've got the gas on. We're not on hookup here at home. So I'm gonna do the inside heating and I'm gonna hold down until it turns blue. And to adjust the temperature, you just go up and down as so. They do have a night set in, which is that one there which it doesn't actually tell us what temperature that is, but it will just keep the, seat, the system going. And then we do have um, one in the winter for just making sure that the system doesn't freeze up. To turn it off the gas, you hold it down again and it will go off. And if you're on a campsite, you will hold down on the electric, which it won't do because I'm not hooked up. And if you hold down, you can either have it on set in one, two or three for the volume um, that you would like and that will help um, heat the vehicle up a lot quicker. And then I'm gonna wave onto the water. It works exactly the same. Hold down till you've got the blue light when you're on gas and you can see it's set on eco mode there. To turn it off, we're gonna hold down until it's, uh, the blue light has gone off. And the same when you're on a campsite, you're gonna hold it down and either strength one, two or three um, for your hot water. Do note, it will take about 30 minutes to heat up. And if you do have an error code, which there will be a, a little exclamation mark come on either of the systems, you can just hold this button down for five seconds and count to five and release it and that should go. You might need to do it a number of times if you have let the system try to start and it hasn't had either gas or electric hookup. 